Simply Spray Stencil Spray is a non-toxic, low-odor spray that is safe to use indoors. You can apply this quick-drying, non-flammable spray over stencil to create unique, customized looks. Today I'm going to show you how to use this spray and a hand-cut stencil to make clothing and accessories for Halloween. Let's get started. First, you're going to need a stencil. You can find all the stencils seen in this video on our website. It's best to print on a thicker paper such as cardstock and then cut out with a craft knife or scissors. Lay your fabric down on a protected surface. We recommend using a temporary adhesive spray on the back of your stencil to keep your stencil in place. Use the scrap paper on all four sides of the template. You might want to tape or secure these scraps as well. Shake your can of stencil spray several times and remove the blue tab at the top. When using Simply Spray products, we recommend starting your spray off of the project, spraying onto it in a smooth motion, and then ending it off to the side again. Place the can about six to eight inches away from the stencil area and begin to spray. After letting it dry for 60 minutes, remove the scrap paper and stencil to reveal your design. For this tote, we added some small splatters of spray for some extra texture and then finished with iron-on letters that say trick or treat. Follow these steps with our other stencils on our website to create other fun Halloween designs, like this spider t-shirt. Visit our website, fashionartprojects.com, for more tips and inspiration with our full line of fashion crafting accessories.